All right, Craig Matt wants to know, what are the red lines? Why are they not printable, and how do you fix them? Well, let's jump right into it. These are the red lines. They are inherently telling you that they're not printable. If you were to export this, put it in a, a print software such as Cura, it will not print. Basically, it's a non-manifold area. Basically, the same thing as this uh, pink color in Mesh Mixer. How do you fix them? Well, sometimes you just can't, and that's how it is. Sometimes you can fix them, but the easiest way to try is to go to the Analysis tab on the side, go to Inspector, that'll open up all your non-printable areas and your problem childs. So, you can cross your fingers, this probably won't work unless it's a really simple design. Cross your fingers and hit Auto Repair All, and hope that works. As you can see with this RuneScape player model, it didn't. Now, red lines, like you saw on the cape earlier, if I back up a step, will not be fixed this way. So, if we were to go back and see what happened, a red bubble just means it won't work. You can see nothing happened. Pink or blue, it will try to fix it the best it can, uh, but ultimately probably won't. So, if you take it slow, so you see if I just check this one purple, it should probably make this disappear, yeah. So, obviously, we don't want that to happen. If we try just a blue, like this brim of this hat, it's got uh, no density to it. It needs thickness. So, inspector's not going to work. So, the only way you're going to be able to fix these red lines is by modeling the cape yourself. That is about the only way to do it. Now, there are a couple ways. If you only want to do it in Mesh Mixer, you can, you can forget about these master cape tassels. That, that's... It's going to be half to designed in uh, Fusion or something. But you can always try selecting a lot of the cape. Get the whole thing. I'm not going to do it here because that's a lot of work. You can take it to the edit. You can try to extrude it and give it thickness. See, this is the, just this, far, this part. But if you can imagine that I had the entire cape grabbed, you'd know that it gets all its thickness. So... There, we just gave the cape thickness. Now, it's more printable. Not entirely, but it's better than how we started. So, basically, you're just going to have to model it yourself. And that's a different video, but I hope this answers the mesh mixer question. So, Craig, let me know if there's a follow-up, but that is how you fix them. And eh, not a good answer to how to fix them, but it is why they, what they are and why they're not printable.